here's that dust. We're saying goodbye, not much of it returning to the Gulf. We've got a break in the Saharan dust. Tracking the tropics, there's some pros and cons to that. Pro is a better air quality. Con is it is allowing for tropical development to be a concern for us. So we have a 60% chance of development now in the Atlantic Basin. There's a little bit of dust out there, but not those stronger plumes that, that really work to inhibit that Saharan or that tropical activity. So this is our area of concern, our tropical wave that is going to continue to push west over the next five days or so. So there is a chance for development as it approaches the Southern Caribbean, those Lesser Antilles Islands there. Here's what we know. It's an area of investigation. We do have this titled as Invest 94L. Uh, the National Hurricane Center tags areas of investigation. They cycle through the numbers 90 through 99, and that L designates that it's in the Atlantic Basin. And what that allows is modeling. Modeling starts to happen once we tag that area of investigation. We can map out those spaghetti plots that does take this tropical system, whatever it may end up being, uh, into that Caribbean Sea as we look ahead to the 4th of July weekend. So this is Saturday, July 2nd, uh, where we could see some tropical development around that time frame. July 2nd heading into 4th of July weekend. So here's what we know. Uh, the models are suggesting the potential for development. We cannot predict that exact track at this time uh, or the intensity and it's impossible to predict any impacts as well. But it's worth watching, not worrying about for Texas and we'll keep you up to date right here with KIII and on our website as well. Uh, this area is does have a decent amount of shear right now, but as we look at to the 28th, we start to lose that wind shear across the Caribbean. But look at those steering winds. They're not going to take much of that activity into the Gulf. So I'm, at this time, I'm really not too concerned for us here in Texas.